Hello, I'm Jim Lamp. We'd like to welcome you to this WDB sanctioned bout between WDB champion Spicy Nacho and challenger Salsa Verde. And here to give the rules to the fight, we go under the ring to our own little ring troll Harold Cheddarman. The Nacho Verde fight is scheduled for 10 rounds using the unified rules of the Chip Boxing Commissions. There's no three knockdown rule. Only the referee can stop the fight in case a cut is caused by accidental headbutt. We go to the scorecards after four rounds have been completed. And you cannot be saved by the bell at any round, including the tenth and final round. Jim! Thank you, Harold. And now let us turn our attentions to the ring where announcer Miguel Buffer is standing by with the particulars. And fighting out of the green, the reigning and defending WBD champion of the world, Salsa. Fighting out of the burgundy corner, he hails from Miami, Florida, by way of Veracruz, Mexico. Introducing the challenger, El Nacho Supremo, Spicy Nacho. I think Salsa Verde is a little bit tentative about the things he's doing in the fight at this point. You're absolutely correct, Lennox, in your assumption. Mainly because I'm seeing the same thing. Let's go to Harold Cheddarman's school card. Harold, how are you scoring the fight? Okay, Jim. Jim, I got the fight. Two rounds to none. 2015 Spicy Nacho. Jim, I gotta tell you something. In the first, I gave Nacho the 10-6 round because of the three knockdown. Anyway, two rounds to none. Spicy Nacho. Thank you, Harold. And Nacho fires a straight right that seems to get Verde's attention. That shot didn't just grab Verde's attention, but it was more like a wake-up call. Nacho catches Verde with a left hook to the body, and there's that punching power. As Verde crumbles to his knees, and the referee steps in. Verde struggling to get to his feet as the referee counts him. I'm not so sure if he's gonna recover from this. 